Hey guys, let's check out Inferto. What is this? It is a game by Gravity Box Studio, released in August 2013. It is still in the alpha stage, and it is looking for alpha funding. The price is £2.99 GBP, that's £2.99, or $4.99. You can get it from Desir or from straight from the website, and all those links are down below. You can also get it greenlit on Steam. It is available on PC, Mac, Linux, and yeah, it's the trifecta. So, what is it? Inverto is <laughs> confusing as hell, that's what it is. Uh, it is a first person shooter puzzler with physical puzzles and gravity manipulations. The game is the <laughs> ideological successor of such games as Prey and Portal with platformer elements. That's the description straight from the game developers itself. So, I've had a little bit of a check out with it, and I can see where he's coming from. It's. <laughs> Oh boy, it, is, it gets real confusing real fast. But if this is it in its alpha stage, I am really looking forward to seeing what it's like when it's finished. So this is the main character, first off, the main level. This is skipping the, tutor to the tutorial, by the way. Stumbling on my own words. So basically, you get, it's just first person shooter, blah -de blah You don't even have anything. Uh, if I come down here, I've noticed there are collectibles in the form of orbs. So collect them. They, I don't know what they do at the moment. They don't have any coherent effect at this moment in time. So standard shooter controls, and if you press shift, it lets you sprint for a short while. And of course, jump! So, if we come down into this first area, you'll notice the gun. So this is the weapon. What does it do? Left click is beam, and the right click lets you zoom. Uh, so let me just sh uh, give you a bit of fair warning here. Uh, I've found this little glitch. If you right click to zoom, uh, you have to let it come all the way back out. If you repeat it and do fast right clicks, you notice how it doesn't zoom out? <laughs> yeah, it gets, it gets a bit difficult to uh, play the game. <laughs> and I haven't found any way to bring it back out. Okay, okay. So the only way to fix that is restart. So I'll just skip ahead until I get back to the gun. So I'm back with the gun, and so what are you supposed to do now? The gun, it doesn't seem to do anything, does it? So uh, if you read this little thing here, it says testing area ahead, yada yada yada. It took me a while to figure this out, but come up to the console, press E, interact, and it opens it up. So you see these little areas on the ground, how it's yellow? Oop, and oh, okay. Instantly, it's getting confusing. So, <laughs> um, there's another orb just down there for your knowledge. So, if we come along here, pop that, and we are now upside down. We need the blue key, so we need to go find the blue key. But because we're upside down, there's an entirely different path for us to go down. So, let's just come along here, <laughs> look up, and yeah, I'm, I'm just speedrunning it essentially at this point. And we are back in the main room. There, so yeah, there is a way to get that orb up there, which is essentially I can't remember. Oh yeah, that's right. Just stand here, shoot that, and you can walk on out. And to get back up, you just stand there and shoot that. But I'm not going to do that because uh, it hurts my brain meats. So just jump back down. Got the blue key, and that's it. Stage one done. Loading screen. That is it. So orbs, you, the collectibles are just for collectibles, obviously. There's level times, level minutes, 53, ignore. Uh, yeah, but obviously that's just the first level, okay? <laughs> Things get a lot more confusing. Oh my lord. Okay, so let's just try jumping down here. So uh, it gave you a message in, oh, hello, what's that? Let's try and get onto that, shall we? Yes, uh, in the first... Ah, I missed. On the first level, it gives you a little message uh, giving you a hint. Basically saying, if you press Q, it will point you automatically in the direction that you meant to go. So if I press Q, boop, straight this way. So I'm in the right area to go where I'm needing to. So let's just... Oh, God. I missed. I missed. So let's just bonk that. This is the completely wrong direction. Um... Oh god, what is going on? <laughs> yeah, so you really need to get a good idea of uh, 3D spatial 
navigation for this game. It, otherwise, you are going to get so confused so fast. So I actually kind of want to be going over that. Nope, that way. I want to be going that way. So I need to try and figure out how to... Ah, like this. No, not like that. Ah. But if I land on that, maybe. Just maybe. I might be able to jump it. Yes. So I can't see anything else to be doing around here. I'm not bothering with orbs. I'm just going to give you a look, quick look through, hopefully, the first two, if this one doesn't foil me in any way. So I want to be going up there. And I want to be going, oh lord, up there? Hey! Come down. Grab the green key. So, where am I maybe going now? Hoop. Down? Oh, in there! Right, okay. So, I just need to bong that there, land on the edge. And we are through, so. That's not the end of the level. I was hoping that would be the end of the level. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, I want to be going over there. See, what can I hit? I guess what I just do is just go. Yeah, there we go. And end of level two. So, at the moment, um, there is currently. Let's see if I can just come out. Main menu. Come on down, Inverto. Start. There is currently 16 levels in the alpha. Uh, now, I'm not entirely sure if all 16 are currently in here. I have not got managed to get all the way through. I've only just got the game, and I'm... It's, it's kind of a love-hate relationship at the moment, mainly for the fact that I love the concept and I love the gameplay. It's smooth, it's uh, easy to control. Uh, the movement is a bit floaty, but I can probably tighten that up in the options. And But the part I hate, is that it, it really hurts my head. Because <laughs> I always tend to play this game... I I tend to play games just before I go to bed, just to kind of, like, wind down after the day. And this is the one game I should not play <laughs> just before I'm about to go to bed. Because, oh my god, it just hurts. Uh, so, yes, if you want to check this out, I will, all the links are down in the description below. Uh, keep an eye out for other games in the checkout series, and we, I am hoping I will to bring you more games that you have not seen or you might have missed. So, thanks again, and I'll catch you next time.